team meet. No grounds. Blit works. This is Meat Boy. This is Bandage Girl. She loves Meat Boy. And Meat Boy loves her. This is Dr. Fetus. Nobody loves Dr. Fetus. And that's why Dr. Fetus hates you. Fuck you. But most of all, Dr. Fetus hates me. So he beat me boy up and kidnapped Bandage Girl. So what are you waiting for? So go save her, hero. Shoot boy! Alright, today is pretty fun. Uh, we're gonna try something a little bit new. We're gonna do a gaming walkthrough, uh, chapter by chapter, level by level, of Super Meat Boy on the PS4. I'm pretty excited. Um, so we'll go ahead and crack right into this. Start game. Now I have played um, first few chapters of this, just kind of getting a feel for it. Um, but I will go through uh, each video be chapter by chapter. So we'll start with the forest on this one. Um, I want you watch this little cinematic. Dr. Fetus being a dick, punching ladies. Stealing girlfriends. Alright, the forest. Uh, so I'll start level one of one. I'm not going for any secrets or hidden items here. Uh, we're just going to be going straight through if I happen to pick up bandages or warp zones. That'll just be extra content. But the main goal is just to kind of show you guys each level uh, and how I uh, ended up solving each level. Most of these beginning ones are pretty basic platforming stuff. Nothing too crazy but uh, you know some people might have challenge with it so just kind of will show you through uh, mind the gap gentlemen um, but yeah no I, I had a blast uh, doing this video and, and playing this game this was a lot of fun uh, brought me back to my old school platforming roots that's the games I started on were platformers you know, one of the first games I can remember playing was uh, Super Mario World 3 as I'm sure a lot of you did uh, still to this day one of my favorite favorite Mario games um, but anyways for platformers Super Meat Boy is, is phenomenal uh, the puzzles that get more and more complex as we go as you can see here now we got buzz saws which can kill us avoid the buzz saws the buzz saws are death um, but yeah no it's it's great uh, each world is comprised of 20 levels um, in those 20 levels, there's different puzzles that vary in difficulty. Uh, obviously, when you start out, puzzles are much simpler, as you've seen, and now they're getting a little bit more and more complex. Uh, funny here, these blocks, uh, you can basically only touch them once, so as you touch them, they disintegrate, as you've seen there. Um, and there's some tricks to that, so you see I do a little slide up, jump over. Uh, you can kind of keep jumping off of it, jumping back. You know, little, little tricks I was picking up as I was playing. Uh, here you just got to keep moving on this level. I think we're on 12 or 11. Just got to keep moving. Yeah, here's 12. Uh, so in this one, I, I'll actually grab the warp zone after I uh, decided to jump way too high off the screen and die. Uh, but I'll grab the warp zone on this one because it gives you... Uh, if you beat all three levels in the warp zone, it gives you a special character. I think this one is... Uh, uh, Commander TV or something like that. I forget. But he's pretty cool. He's, uh, as you'll see demonstrated here, he's got a jump, like a hover jump, similar to Peach from Super Mario 2. Um, he's got this little, like, floating in the air thing. It's pretty good. You know, he's got a little rainbow trail. Okay. Oh, the Commander. That's it. Yeah. Commander video. So. Uh, that was in World 12, I just move on to World 13 here, uh, and I decided to play the rest of this world out as the Commander, just because I thought he was pretty fun. You know, they don't vary too much, most of them are cosmetic, some of them have little 
special traits, like I said, with him. Um, but as you can see, the, way, the levels in World 1 are pretty straightforward. Um, just avoid the buzz saws, keep jumping wall to wall. I find myself playing this constantly holding down the run button, or the sprint button, whatever you want to call it. Some people don't do that. You know, I, I notice that they kind of go on and off doing that. I just find it easy because I feel like if I start the game getting used to that mechanic, and only that mechanic, that I can self-compensate when not using it. So you'll see a lot of times I take riskier jumps, but for me, it pays off a lot faster, and I get to the end a lot quicker. Um, anyways, I want to use this little bit of a lull time here, while these levels are basic, to uh, to thank you guys. Uh, everybody that's been watching the videos, everybody that's been subscribing. Um, as you guys all know, I'm, I'm pretty new to doing these YouTube interweb videos, um, but I've had so much fun already. You know, it's a blast making content for you guys, and uh, and I just want to keep growing that. You know, right now my goal is to get up to 100 subscribers, so I uh, appreciate all your help in that. Um, that just allows me to continue to make content for you guys and get better and better every time. So, uh, yet again, thank you for everything you guys have done so far, and uh, hopefully we'll continue to do in the future. If there's anything special you guys want to see, you know, post that up in the comments, send me a message. Uh, you know, I'm here because of uh, uh, my passion for gaming, but that doesn't mean uh, I'm not willing to make any content that you guys want to see. So, anyways, thanks again. Uh, once you've completed all 20 levels, there's a boss stage, which you'll see here. You'll notice uh, Dr. Fetus kind of crosses many, many politically correct lines, like starting a forest on fire, now has this giant chainsaw machine that you'll see. Uh, this is pretty straightforward, just jumping over buzz saws to avoid them. You basically have to do an outrun to the end. Um, learn to time your jumps, be careful here when you get to the sand uh, blocks that disintegrate. Just take your time, you actually have more time than it makes you think you do. So just be careful, go through it. Um, here it also makes you think that you need to get to the top, you don't. If you stand in the lower right corner as you see me do, you still can defeat uh, this boss. But uh, follow those steps and you should be pretty pretty easy. You know, you might die a few times and just keep at it. It's fairly simple. Then you see me, boy, basically like, hey, what's up, man? Come on. And Dr. Fetus takes the girl off into the sunset. So, uh, but this is pretty hilarious. Uh, not to piggyback off of my PETA video, but I'm sure PETA is having a freaking field day right now. Seeing uh, the land of dead squirrels here. But, uh, you get the little, little sad squirrel. Oh, eh, sad. Buzzsaw. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for video one. Um, I will be doing a video a night, uh, finishing up through episode seven. So be on the lookout tomorrow for world two, which uh, I believe is the hospital. So thanks again guys. Hit that like button down below and also subscribe if you haven't already. Um, check out my PETA video that I mentioned. That is a riot. So far, that has been my most popular video. Everybody's been loving that one. Uh, so check that out down below. Uh, also, a link to my Facebook and Twitter in the description. Uh, I look forward to speaking with you guys tomorrow. All right? Have a good night.